Well, hey there. How are you? I swear, sometimes my days off are like my busiest days. And I've always got these grand YouTube related plans that I want to implement and it becomes very difficult to do so. That's okay. A couple things I wanted to talk about today from the production vlog aspect of things. As of this morning, I woke up to find that I had reached 9,999 overall lifetime views on my channel. I'm saying this because I wanted to timestamp the fact that I wrote to YouTube today. I used the help and send feedback button on the channel with the screenshot of my monetization page that says, yeah, you are authorized for monetization, which by the way, never changed. They just stopped rolling the ads. And basically said in a nice professional way, hi there, wanna let you know that I crossed 10,000 views today. The creator's blog doesn't say very much about this review process to have the ads placed back on your videos. So I'm just kind of inquiring and hoping to find out how long that's gonna take and I'm really anxious to getting back to monetizing my videos. Uh, you know, always end a message like that with something nice like, you know, thank you so much for your time and I hope you're having a great day. So that's one thing. Also today I started gathering up a bunch of really great Q&A questions that I will be putting into my one year anniversary video. Uh, I began YouTube on June 18th of 2016, so in just a little less than two weeks, I will cross that threshold. It's really kind of cool that the day, uh, the 18th, actually falls on my regular upload day, which is Sunday, very cool. So I uh, solicited video uh, questions. I was hoping that some YouTubers would bust out their cameras and record their questions and send them over to me uh, to ask in the Q&A so I can get back a little bit, you know? It's not just saying, oh, this is from, you know, such and such channel and here's their link. Like, I want their face on my video. I think that's really cool. So I got questions uh, via video from four people, I think, and uh, probably three, four more uh, just written ones that people posted out there for me. So. I'm doing something special that uh, I've done a few times on the channel that I've really enjoyed when I did it, and um, I'm just gonna try to up the game just a little bit. So we prepare to celebrate one full year of driving me crazy. One thing I'm definitely going to start doing in the production vlog is talk some more about the YouTubers that I'm friends with. In my real life, outside of YouTube, I am a manager. I'm not Lumber from Office Space. Certainly not Michael Scott from The Office. When I look at what I do professionally, my job is to help people be the best at their job. I've always looked towards the success of others to measure my own success. If you're doing well, then I must be doing well. And in a lot of ways, I look at YouTube like that too. I interact daily and weekly with so many cool people that I wish I could just be in one big channel with all of them. The least I can do is point them out from time to time. So I think one of the things I'm gonna do as part of these production vlogs is spotlight another YouTuber. There's so many talented people that are working hard to grow their channels just like I am. And I know I will feel better about giving back a little bit in uh, highlighting those people. So just a little update check in here today. It's like I'll make my own little YouTube proverb of may your views be high and your subscribers be plentiful. May your like button be smashed and may your comments section be full. As always, my friends, thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time.